Hey everyone, Tragic here with kind of a random buy. This is from MVP Sports and Games Online, who I buy a lot of booster boxes from. Uh, they were offering as a way to clear their inventory, I think, um, kind of a deal where you would actually offer a certain amount, and if you didn't offer enough, they would not send it to you. Um, this is for a couple of play mats. They're supposed to be either rare or old, or rare and old, I'm not sure. So we're going to see. Um, that's kind of the mystery. And as a bonus, like free bonus, um, you're going to get, for each lot, you'd get eight of the uh, Crimson Vow box toppers. Um, so I actually ordered two play mats, and uh, so I should have 16 of these Vow box toppers in here. So that'd be fun to go through and see what play mat I get. And um, the first time I offered um, 50 bucks each, I did not, they did not accept my order. So I had to come back with a little bit of higher offer. I offered 85 bucks each. Um, apparently that was acceptable. That essentially puts those Val box toppers at about the going rate, and I'm essentially getting f two free play mats. So hopefully they're like really good ones, at least ones that I will like, and hopefully not just a copy or a duplicate. I want two different ones, and that looks like they gave me the same one. That's kind of a bummer. Oh well. Let's see here. We got at least make sure one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So we got sixteen vowel box toppers. And then the play mat. Two play mats. Oh cool. It's a uh, gosh, it's a border post. I don't know which one it is, but it's kind of the gruel. Um not sure what that one is from like a Lara block. It's not Mist Veil border post, right? It's some of the kind of border post. Very cool art. It's, uh, I don't think I see this one too often. I really would have rather had two different ones than two of the same one, but the, apparently that's what it is. It was basically a mystery. They must have a ton of these that they're trying to get rid of. And this is what I end up with. So anyway, let's move on to the box toppers. Let's see how we do there. I guess what, what it should do Put one of my new play mats down and use that, right? There it is. All right, here we go. Innistrad box toppers. And uh, as always, I will be scanning them up and hopefully getting <laughs> enough to, uh, to recoup my investment here out of these box toppers, so. I have not really bought any uh, boxes of Crimson Vow yet, so this is going to just hopefully be the goods, like alternate versions. Uh, I think we're looking for a Soren. Not sure what el what everything's worth nowadays. There's a mysterious blood illness, Vampire's Vengeance. So these are all like Dracula themes. So let's see how the scanner does with that. And the scanner does have trouble with foil, especially alternate border foil so this may take a little doing here yep might have to actually add that in manually and uh, maybe what i'll do is at the end scan the ones in that don't get scanned let's just move on for now I'm trying to make a a watchable video here we got abraham van helsing it's the savior of all and back it's a mythic Human soldier. He's a one-two with training, and he can exile some stuff and do some things. Let's see if the scanner can see him. Doesn't look like it. All right, let's do this here. Savior of Allenbach, uh, Abraham Van Helsing. Being that was three seventeen, so we got a ways to go. The the uncommon one probably not gonna be a whole lot, so. Hoping for some big ones here. Try not to bend these up as I pull them out. That's one of the goals here. Nope, I totally nicked it. Let's see, was this a good one? Search the Count's Castle. Thirst for discovery. Draw three cards. So it's an uncommon, probably not a big one. Okay, the scanner did see it. It's only 42 cents. Moving on.
And uh, another thirst for discovery, 42 cents. So that may be how these end up. <laughs> I don't, know what, I don't know what the top end of these is. Is there one that's worth like a super big amount that's going to put me over the top here? <laughs> not getting the three in a row that are exactly the same. That's not going to do it. Let's see. What do we got here? Lucy. Oh, it's a flip one. Lucy Western, uh, Innocent Traveler. Very cool looking art. That looks good in the foil. Malicious Invader on the back. So actually, I do like the original art for this, and the uh, flavor text that goes with it is pretty cool. Let's see, can I see it? Only 38 cents. Got all our hopes pinned on probably a Soren. All right, let's see here. Van Helsing's Holy Ward and Uncommon. All right. Let's see if I can see that. Not a big one. Another holy ward. All right, seeing a trend. This one looks like it will be a rare at least. So we got Dracula, Lord of Blood, Voldaren Bloodcaster. Very cool looking. Dracula Lord of Bats on the back, the Blood Bat Summoner, and it's very dark. It's hard to hard for the scanner to see it. Come on, scanner. No. Nope. Okay. So let's do. I wonder if it will see it as Dracula. Hmm. Lord of Blood, no. It doesn't see it, so it's got to be the Voldaren Bloodcaster. The Dracula version. $2.71. Big time right there. Okay, next up. About halfway through this already. And have not gotten a fraction of my money back. There we get Dr. John Seward. It's Torin's Fist of the Angels. So there's kind of like a human training lord there. And it's 85 cents. It's a rare at least. And another mysterious blood illness. Yeah, the uncommons don't seem to be super big in these. Let's see, we've got Quincy Harker, Reclusive Taxidermist. Let's check, see if, we, see if we can see that one. So like shade it just right from the glare. And it doesn't work, so we'll add it. Reclusive Taxidermist. Bink, it's only 37 cents, okay. Definitely, that's a trend with the uncommons. All right, need a need a big mythic here. Van Helsing's Holy Ward. That's not it. Oh, we got another flip card there. Let's see the back of it. It is a mythic. It's the three weird sisters. Henrika Dominatha. Very cool. I like the art. Definitely like that. So and the fiends of darkest night. The infernal seer on the back. Let's see. Be nice if we just scan it. There we go. Eight bucks. So there's so far the best of the bunch. Move all this out of the way here. Two more. I'm guessing an uncommon. Nope. Renfield, delusional minion for Aerith, tormented prophet. Looks good. And the scanner, yeah, it can't do it. It just can't do it. So we got Aerith. 
Spink under a buck. 68 cents. All right, last pack here. It has to be super amazing. It's probably not going to be. We've got Quincy Harker again. So there we go. That was what I got out of 16 Crimson Val box toppers. Um, maybe not the best um, blockbuster that I've ever had, but at least I got uh, to have a little fun opening some packs. And I got two of the same play mats. I guess I'll probably give one to a friend. And then I will move on. So anyway, thanks for watching. I'll catch you on the next one.